thinks, he like pauses, and he's like, no, three. Three time, three time Togeki champion. He had to think about it yeah, though? Yeah, he had to think about it. Wow, that's how you know when you're pretty good at this yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. All right, games in general, it's, it's probably not just Street Fighter no, 4. No, two on Virtual Fighter, one yeah. on Street Fighter. Yeah. Uh, he's a very strong player. It's no surprise that his, his Virtual Fighter game transferred over here. He's had, he has amazing reactions and the reads bred well over time. Yeah, and option selects are old hat to Virtual Fighter players. That's right, that's true. Very normal part of the game. That's true. Yeah, so EG Justin Wong. Justin Wong, the best player in uh, Marvel 2 uh, ever. Oh, and yeah. and uh, ever since then, I mean, in, in just about any game, in Third Strike, he was one of the best Americans. In Street Fighter 4, he's been one of the best Americans. Just an incredibly talented guy, and now he's in losers of Top 32 trying to battle on against Fudo. He's one of the best Americans ever produced, but likewise, Fudo is one of the best that Japan has ever produced. This is a real matchup of the Titans, and already Justin is getting pushed by that strong corner push ability of Fei Long. Yeah, it's so tough to stay out of the corner against Fei. When he hits you, he moves you to the corner. When he blocks, or when you block him, you move to the corner. And when you stand there, you can't help but get him move backwards sometimes because of the threat that he brings to bear. Yep. yep. Oh, the wake up. Justin spends it just to get him off of him. But now he's that much further from three meters for the FADC. Oh, the oh. dive kick won't go. What am I telling you about those reactions? That was clean. Justin might try to take advantage of that. Yeah, he's just going to whiff some of the dive kicks, try to make him bite, bite on that. Nice confirmed. Justin gets into the ultra. He's not going to kill on this. But he'll get a setup for himself afterward where he can take it. Let's see what he does. Nice OS here. Oh, he just gets the cross up. Okay, that, that works out too. Round one goes to Justin Wong. That, that was so well timed. I think it flubbed Fudo's inputs. I don't think he was going for the flame kick. I think he wanted the uh, chicken. Yeah, Justin Wong always manages to make Rufus's ground game look better than it really is. I'm always impressed by his use of sweep and medium kick. Makes his character look a lot more complete than anybody else can. Already in the corner again. Oh, looking for the whiff punish. Those reactions. Slightly late. Comes in, Justin. But blown right backwards. Yeah, man. Right now, Fudo is just playing the door, man, and Justin wants out. Good damage from Fudo, better than he can get with Rekas. He's already in the corner, so no need for that. Yeah, he'll just guard that line, man. Yeah, it's now finding the sweeps. Oh, the backdash by Fudo. What was he looking for? Well, Justin again with the sweep. Can he get in this time? Another chance, maybe another chance? Oh, jump back strong. You don't see that option too often, but it worked out great there. He got fed up with all those dive kicks and just wanted to get out of there. And it's kind of worked out in his favor. Now Justin playing very cognizant of this corner push ability, trying to guard his ground with the neutral jumps. But Fudo is just uh, so sparing with these Rekkas, Justin can't get a great read on him. By the way, Shen beats Luffy in, in winners. Ah. Uh, the upset goes averted. Yep. Oh, he was looking to snipe the dive kick. He had the he had the dive kick itself. Justin did, but no combo afterward. Justin is really trying to find a way into Fudo's mind. Get him to whiff something to get a punish. But it's a slow game, and Justin is okay with playing that. Uh, like unlike almost any other Rufus, he's okay with that. Mm. He can play a ground game. He can play it patiently. Fudo now again has the corner as we fought from. That's the setup. Solvus. He's got an EX to get out of it, and he does. Fudo really needed to see that. He should have saw that coming. All right, Justin had the cross up, I think, before. It was kind of tough to see what it was going to be. A oh, backdash! And the he's grab. ready for it. And Justin just backs off again. He's okay with this slow paced game. The grab punishes that. Do it! Not quite. And Justin's now just going to play reactively. If Fudo comes in, Justin's going to have. Uh, an EX waiting for him. We'll Just see if it comes up. He's got to watch for that surprise flame kick. It's two meters loaded on Fudo, and he can't take any chip. Justin not taking any risk. There he it is. His input. Yes, he did. That was definitely supposed to be chicken wing. That's a heartbreaker. <laughs> he was at a great range for it. Are you ready? Fight! Justin Wong up one game here against Razor Fudo. Trying to eliminate the champion from two years ago. Justin hasn't won Street Fighter 4 at EVO. Uh, and I know he wants he to do it. He hasn't been top 8 since 2009. Mm. Trying to get there. Delayed dive kick. The second one goes. Fudo trying to hide behind those arms now. But Justin finds a sweep. 
The good thing about what Justin's doing is that he's making Pluto pay, pay attention to both the air and the ground with those sweeps. He keeps trying to stand to deal with the dive because it's coming in, but when he stands up, Justin has the sweep, and that has made it really tough on Pluto to deal with both angles. He's splitting his attention. He's making it so he has to look up, he's got to look down, he's got to think twice about how he's going to react to something, and he's just taking away the luxury of comfort. Yeah, nobody's perfect. It's hard to pay attention to both sides at once. Even the best in the world find that troublesome. Yeah. Justin takes the opportunity there to walk a little bit forward. It's little things like that that I really appreciate about Justin's play. He understands when Pluto's going to back off and when he can just move a little bit away from the corner. It's crucial against this character. You need to... Every, every inch of space counts. Justin gets the block. Pluto's really got to start making things happen here. It's getting tough on him. Justin's kept him out, interestingly enough, which is tough with Rufus. Justin's made things happen when he needs to, when he comes in. This is a, this is a very different approach for the matchup in general, and I think it might be throwing Fudo off his game a little bit. Usually Rufus is coming in, Fei Long's playing the defense, and he gets his, da his damage on you as you come in. There's none of that's happening here. Oh, good block by Justin. There's nothing but the most well-placed dive kicks and in a sparing little sweep here and there. Justin's playing this immaculately. What a read! Oh, he just oh, stays in front. and another read! Misses Link, but he doesn't... Oh, he doesn't get oh, the ultra. Oh, man, Justin's got all the momentum here. Good block. Oh! oh! Some damage. Fudo trying to chase down the back dash. But didn't come. Justin just plays patiently. 18 seconds left now. Can he stay alive or can Fudo get back in? Oh, Wudo! One more chance here for Fudo. Oh, Justin, this might can, be he, it. can he stay away? Can he stay away? Nine seconds. He's got that ultra for the ultra scam. Eight seconds. If he can get down to two seconds, he has this thing one. We'll see. Maybe not. Here comes Fudo. He's got to let him rip. He won't. He's going to down back at Justin Wong. Eliminates Fudo. That's it. Justin stays alive. That play at the end where he just waited, he was playing reactively. He wasn't going to bring out any buttons, let Fudo have any opportunity to deal more damage than needed to be done.